Okay. Oh, you brought a picture of something. Can I see? What are the what? Are these tadpoles? Yeah. I think I've seen a picture of them in a book. Hmm. I remember now. Arundaspis? <laughs> How'd you take this picture? Where in the world could you take this kind of picture? Our readers may think that we're using fake pictures. If so, oh, it's all on you, Dave. I'm just kidding. Haha. <laughs> I'll put your picture to good use. I'm sure the readers will love it. Damn. There are photo spots all over the place. Thank you for your help and keep up the good work. <laughs> it's only afternoon now, eh? Ooh, there's some crops. Let's head to the farm. Okay. Beyond my way. Let's head to the sushi spot. Let's, uh, let's talk to Boncho first. Boncho, do you have recipes that use cucumbers? Well, I personally don't like cucumbers, but a chef should be able to deal with any food ingredients given. I know a few recipes. Oh, nice. There will be an event hosted by the cucumbers not far from here. That is a strange name for a community. Well, I prepared several cucumber dishes and the dishes to the menu when you have the ingredients ready. Nice. Do we have our new applicants yet? No, we don't. Okay. Let's feed this kitten. Oh, we already fed them. Alright, uh, back to the boat. Fang tooths and opals. Is there anything else I'm to do right now? We just gotta kill some spider crabs and some fang tooth and opal. And like that's it. Where the hell are fang tooth at? You little fang tooth. Yeah, you're a little fang tooth. Okay. Let's go to the Sea People Village then. Yeah, the cats in this game rock. Wait, you know what? Let's go check uh, our crops real quick. Our little RC crops. Ah, uh, but yeah, this game rocks. Love, love the game. Hope everyone's having a nice Sunday. Good to see y'all. I was gonna switch over to Super Mega Baseball like earlier than this, but I, I'm on like a little roll. I'm enjoying it. Let me open another plot on the next day, apparently. Okay. Having a great Sunday? Hell yeah. Happy to hear it. Hell yeah. <laughs> Rainy Sunday? Yeah, am I also raining here on and off? I'm mad, so I woke up after the rain ended, I went outside to check the garden, and a lot of it was like pest ravaged again. So I treated it all again, but then it immediately rained again. So I think I'm just gonna have to treat it again. But I don't want to like kill the plants. It's just the pepper plants that are getting eaten. Tomatoes are fine. The eggplant's finally starting to produce. Cucumbers are fine. But all of my pepper plants are getting eaten. Go to sleep. Or just die, I guess. I gotta find one more fang tooth. I 
I just gotta kill some crabs. No, I have not looked into that. Some marigolds around the edge of the garden? I can do that, I can do that. A lot of guns in the ocean. the seaweed collector Tushi and his pet leatherback sea turtle? What was his name again? <sighs> Leo? What was it Leo? Hmm, something's not right. Anyway, it's a wonderful sight to see a leatherback turtle in the deep sea. Time for a pick. Ah, Tushi, the sea people shouldn't be in the picture. I'll have to keep him out of the shot. No. Oh. I thought I did a good job. Oh, feeding time. Oh, whoops. I accepted it. I meant to retake it. Whatever. I'm surprised I haven't seen any crabs yet. Yeah. Just to handle that is. <clears throat> Sticky tranquilizing bomb gun. I think mine is still better. I'm gonna disassemble this.
Oh, I'm gonna drink some water real quick. Got a tickle. I hate that this jug leaks. Got water all over myself. <clears throat> I should have hit escape. I'm just you're losing air. <laughs> yeah, I'm hitting my O2 tank. My H2O tank. Sleep time. Sleep time. I'm just kind of ocean exploring. Just having a nice little, nice little swim about, you know. See if I fucking care. Mm. Oh. Uh oh. Hmm. That's a dead end. Hmm. Oh. You'll go to sleep. You'll go to sleep. some air is what I need. Or I need to go. A little concerning. Oxygen tank in here for sure, right? Oh my god, it's just pickaxes all the way down. I've got like a minute. <clears throat> I got a little over. I got like probably like two minutes. I feel like I haven't seen an exit in a very long time. Yeah, fuck it, go in. It refilled my oxygen in here, let's go. <laughs> Is there anything else for me to do in here? I wonder if it, my oxygen's gonna be fucked when I leave again. No, my shit did refill. That owns the fucking rocks. And there is an exit right here. <clears throat> I already mined this. Ooh. 
Let me shoot you. Take a little nap there, bud. I'm just gonna head on back. guys oh you wrote a picture or something can I see <clears throat> wow a leatherback turtle do so you know that his back is actual leather that's why I can't hide its head inside its own shell how sad I'll put your picture to good use I'm sure the readers will love it what's up vamp there are photo spots all over the place thank you for your help keep up the good work sir I'm ready to take pictures of manta rays I hired some lighting guys, uh, and made them set up lighting fixtures at the right places. Oh, you must have spent some money. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> one can't pass up an opportunity like this. They told me that the light lighting fixtures were set at a depth of 20 meters. Can you please check them out? I expect awesome pictures then. Uh, should I go do that tonight? I don't want to re-dispatch everyone right away. Ooh. Their serving is huge. So is Billy's. Alright. We'll check them both out when we get back. Uh, let me just check the old farm now app. Alright, nothing's ready to be harvested. <clears throat> I think I have to go underwater tonight and lose a third of the evening. Does that have to be at night? Like, will I fail it if I don't do it tonight? I'm gonna ignore it. <laughs> I want to go to the sushi restaurant. I got stuff I gotta do there. <clears throat> yeah, I'd imagine it's any night. everyone, this is Yui from NGC Station. We have been waiting for today. Today we will see how this old conflict ends with whose victory. Bancho, are you ready? Yes. Pastro? Sono pronto! Let's get it started! Excellent, then let's begin challenge the chef now. What? ATJ Spices in chat? ATJ Spices? <laughs> I'm not ready. Ah, oh, shit. Alright, fucked up. Terrible. Yeah, brother! Church. Whew. 
Terrifying. Delusional Eye, happy 21 months. Thank you. My arm hurts. <laughs> Oof, and my mouse is dying. I gotta plug it in. Let's go, let's go. <laughs> Ooh, 95, that's the lowest I've gotten. I've gotten a 99 each time. <clears throat> well, let me plug my mouse in. Mamma mia, I can't believe it. I have Pastro Antio Giovanni defeated in a pasta contest. I can't accept the judge's call. This show is lame and is not worth my time. Or a barely. There he goes. Oh, that guy's hot tempered. His, his uh, carbonara was fantastic, though. It was unbelievable. I liked the combination of salty guanciale and soft yolk sauce. It was heavenly. Then why didn't he win, Vincent? Miss Lois, do you know why squid ink is used in dishes? What, isn't that for the color? Why bother making the color like that, though? Not really, Miss Lois. The visual is only part of the reason. Squid ink is reminiscent of the taste of nature's seawater. When I tasted Bancho's pasta, I saw the dark and quiet sea. Black pasta, nocturnal sea creatures all uh, dotting the black sea. It felt like diving into the dark, quiet sea, naked at night. <laughs> Why naked, though? <laughs> Tastiness is a very subjective experience, after all. Even for a critic like myself, it's never easy to be objective. I liked the taste of both dishes equally. However, I gave more points to Bancho for his near-perfect representation of the theme in every nook and cranny of his dish. Your reasoning is so absurd. Do you know who the biggest sponsor of your program, don't you? I do know. Nolan Crawford, the chairman of the BNC Group, who is your father. He's also my sensei. You, you know my father personally? How is that possible? Damn. Alright, we got a little film. When I was young, I worked at your father's restaurant in New York. Back then, I was nothing but an inexperienced apprentice cook. I was lucky to be hired by your father. My first job was cooking omelets. Although egg is a pretty common ingredient, it is one of the hardest to master. It's very hard, uh, it's very hard to time the perfect moment to flip the omelet in a frying pan. I was struggling to figure that out. And... Someone tapped my shoulder with a smile on his face. It was your father, Nolan Crawford. <laughs> Ooh, hot dad. <laughs> he kindly taught me when and how to better flip the egg. He, the restaurant owner, didn't mind spending his precious time teaching a new hire. His passion and creativity toward food were truly inspirational. He was always looking for new tastes and experimented with new recipes. He failed more times than I can remember, but he would succeed in the end. I see. <laughs> I love Dave's expressions. 
He's now an entrepreneur of a large corporation, but I believe his passion would never change. I could feel it. Oh, Miss Lois, why don't you try Boncho's pasta yourself? Oh. Well, if you insist. It's <laughs> horrific. <laughs> Notably not naked. I admit I was prejudiced. <laughs> this pasta is incredible. Hello, Herc. What's up? It's not just the visual. It carries the natural flavor of each ingredient. And I criticized his dish without even trying it. I'm not worthy to be a restaurant critic. Don't blame yourself. We just have different philosophy about food. Bancho? I know it's a rather abrupt offer, but would you be interested in opening a branch? A branch? Yes, another Bancho Sushi. Clearly there are many people who don't understand your food philosophy. But if they taste your food at least once, they will wake up to a new dimension of food. Mm. I want them to have that mind-blowing opportunity. Oh. But your current restaurant is too small. It's big enough for me. Mm. Your restaurant is already widely known. People will visit your place in droves sooner or later. <clears throat> uh. There's so many games in this game. You need to be prepared to maintain the quality of the food you serve. Mm. But if he opens a branch, it will be harder for him to control the food quality. Mm. He has staff members who sincerely follow his philosophy, right? They could be the manager of the branch. Manager, you say? Don't worry, trust your staff. They know what to do to live up to the reputation you built. Trust your staff and let more people taste your food. But I don't have a management system and funds to open a branch yet. That I could help you with. I know how to operate a franchise. I am well educated in that matter by my father. I have the skills and money needed. And I won't ask for anything in return. Consider this your reward for winning the contest. Well, I'm not sure if this is right. Pancho Sushi without me? Pancho, I think you should give it a try. This will be a good challenge for the staff to grow further. Um, if that's everyone's thought, I have no other choice. Okay, I will open a branch. What am I supposed to do, though? Order wooden planks or something? Don't worry about the construction. B&C Company will take care of it. You just name the manager and decide what to serve with what ingredients, Pancho. Well, it's about time for the night shift. The construction will be completed by tomorrow morning. She must be kidding. Anyway, I realized that I was close-minded about new approaches to food. I apologize for my poor review of your dish in the past. From now on, I will help you spread your food far and wide. I will contact you again when the branch is ready for business. Cool. Nice. Okay. So staff first. We have new hires. Let me see the details. Serve drink perfectly. Clean up messy seats quickly. Okay, that's huge. And their serving will top out around a thousand. Uh, what's your deal? Clean up a messy seat, serve cocktails. Their serving also gets up there. We already have a cocktail guy. Cooking, increase plates. Okay, so I think this is who we're looking to get, for sure. And they're gonna replace our other person who serves drinks. Let's hire you. Okay. Hmm. My mouse keeps turning off and back on and I don't know why. Plugged in. Oh, it's not plugged in. Maybe? No, it is plugged in. What the hell? There we go. Noun bees, thank you for the gift to you, Fire Red Lily. Thank you. Thank you for the gift to you. Welcome on back, Fire Red Lily. How you doing? <clears throat> So now we're going to go out of here. We're going to swap you with the new guy. And then we're going to train them a bunch. 
I'm gonna keep going. I'd love to get them the seven. Let's go. <laughs> God, they're even better than the Raptor at serving, which is great. Okay. Now. Let me look at the menu first. We do be needing mayo and sesame seeds for that. Lots of mayo, lots of sesame seeds. What else are we low on? Anything? More mayo and sesame seeds. Sesame seeds. Dispatch, mayo. Dispatch, mayo. <laughs> Dispatch, mayo. Dispatch, mayo. <laughs> now hold on, before I go further, we need more points. We need more inspiration to get this stuff. I want to see if any of these have other stuff in them. No. Okay. Damn. These all serve 10. We'll do this one. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> like 16 people sent out, all to get mayo. Cool, cool. Alright, staff. Mayo, 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 mayo. Sesame seeds. Sesame seeds. Sesame seeds. <laughs> Sesame seeds. Mayo. <laughs> Mayo. And sesame seeds. <clears throat> Beautiful. Uh, nothing that was relevant. I was just upgrading people to see what their thing would be, and it was nothing that helped with gathering, so I just didn't bother. Because uh, pretty much everyone in there is only ever going to gather. Yeah, he exclusively is my mayo fetcher. <laughs> He's a professional mayo fetcher. I've only got one of those tongues. Same way I only have one of these tails. Maybe I should serve this stuff though. I never served this one. Hold on, let me check the old phone. <clears throat> what do we need for a rank up? We need our best taste to be 375, okay. Yeah, I don't have a dancing emote. <clears throat> yeah, my, my arms do the dancing.
<clears throat> Sorry, just checking a few messages. <clears throat> yeah. All right, since we are trying to make a lot of money, fuck it, let's put this out. We'll put one of those. What else we got? These are all like multiple servings dishes. Yeah, let's give it another enhance. Oh, hello. This is my favorite of the cutscenes. I want to, uh, Rini, are you here? I know Rini made an emote for Dave the Diver, and I think it's on BTTV. I just don't know how to enable it. <clears throat> you know what? Before we open, let me go to the, uh, fish farm. Can you link me it again, Rini? Either in chat or like a DM, wherever. I'll take, I'll take a look. That was loud. Thank you. All right, so oh, I think I could literally just add two channel. Yes. <laughs> That's beautiful. Full as hell. Let's uh just sell that. Uh, let's send that to the old kitchen. Let's just send all of them to the kitchen. Send all of these to the kitchen too. Can I open a, uh, another one? Let's see. There's new stuff. We don't have a glacier one yet. Oh, we wasted so much. Oh, I expanded the glacier passage. I have to open the glacial area. I also have to open hydrothermal vent zone. Back to the sushi. Alright. Now we go back to menu. these out but like auto supplied <clears throat> we'll put these out and auto supply hmm. what else do I want to serve tonight we're gonna enhance that I want to make sure all 10 of those go. You know, we could also do, uh, we'll do one of these. Let's open on just this and see where we get.
I love our new server. Everyone should be fast. Oh, look at how fast they move. They're amazing. And they, they pour drinks so fast, it's crazy. <clears throat> I was gonna keep that shit full. Oh my god, they clean fast too. I don't even have to do anything in zones. I'll just run some dishes. Uh, I've only done this once. That shit takes forever. Oh, he's refilling. Did we have just enough stuff? Did anyone come in and be like, oh, there's no more food and leave? So that was a big day. Ooh. Yeah, it's like some people were mad. Miss Lois? No. The branch is ready for business. That quickly? Uh. Ah, the administrative agency of the BNC group is on top of the industry. Mm -hmm. Visit the branch of Boncho. I'll see you there. Damn. Oh, wow. <clears throat> New branch up. Ooh. Oh, this is the branch. The place gives off a tropical vibe. Not exactly my taste, but it blends in well with the surrounding environment. time-proven theme for restaurants on the beach. <clears throat> Let me explain how to run your branch. Obviously, you need staff members to run your business. Open the staff menu below. You need at least three staff members to run the store. Hmm, do I need that many? Yes, because neither you nor Dave will be there at the branch. So you need to hire a manager to supervise business there. And of course, you need to staff the, the dining area and kitchen as well as just like at HQ. This is why you need a minimum of three staff members to open and run the branch. Hmm, manager. Mm. Right, the manager is the most important. Uh. It is because the number of ingredients available and the number of customers depend on the stats of your manager. <clears throat> okay. It is best to appoint a staff member with the highest stats to the manager position. Mm. Oh, if I appoint a manager, they will run the business on their own? Uh. Nope, your manager cannot run the business against the operation policy of the HQ. You need to set an operation policy to give guidance to the manager according to which the manager will prepare the menu appropriately. God damn. So, I could instruct the manager what to serve as I see fit, right? Like expensive dishes or dishes with the most ingredients first? Yes, exactly. Let's talk about ingredients. Open the ingredient menu below. The grade of your manager determines the ingredients used at the branch. Check the ingredients currently available and predict the sales revenue. Well, it seems like there's no ingredients at the branch at the moment. And that's because it's not open yet. You can bring ingredients from HQ or the fish farm at any time. Mm -hmm. Would you click the deliver button below? Mm -hmm. You can send or receive ingredients from here. As I said earlier, your manager cannot use ingredients whose grade is higher than theirs. I see. I'm sure you now understand what to do with the branch. Wahaha! <laughs> -ha, I now own a second restaurant! That means twice the revenue! Only if you run it successfully, I might add. Mm -hmm. 
We will see how it goes, okay? Let more people experience your culinary revolution. I'm sure they will love your recipes. Okay. Well, everyone's out getting mayonnaise. <laughs> Would I have to just cancel the mayonnaise event? <clears throat> Can I just come back here tomorrow? God, I would hate to lose the raptor as a server, though. I want to go hire more people. So here, let me go back to my own place. Oh, well, back to the sushi place. Is there a management stat, or is it just like combined stats? At the very least, they're a server I'll hire for this place. What do you upgrade into? Your cooking gets good. Okay, we'll hire you as a cook. What do you do? You clean and serve cocktails. 666 Procure, huh? Put out another internet ad. <clears throat> it did sound like combined stats. Okay, let's go to the waiting room. God, who here has good stats? Maybe I should just take someone who's level five back. I wish I could see their oh god. I wish I could see uh, their stats from here. Oh, I can't even like cancel them. Okay. It's, uh, it's Raul. I don't know how to, like, I don't think I can camp. I could, like, bring him back, right? Because, like, they're in the middle of dispatching. I wish I could just call them off. Be like, hey, come back. Get back here. But it doesn't look like that's an option. So I'm gonna have to just wait until tomorrow, I guess. It is a kitten. Oh, 
I'll get everyone the seven. Oh, whoops. I just put him to eight on accident. <laughs> Beautiful. All right, so we're gonna go head over to the old branch. Is it easy to swap a man? Well, no, I don't have anyone available. I think I just staff the other restaurant tomorrow, I guess, huh? What does time skip do? Will that just put me to like the next day? I don't wanna do that. Let's feed that kitten. And this cat loves us. Momo, Momo loves us. Alright, let's head to the farm. Don't do it. Ooh. Okay. Let's harvest some stuff. Buddy, I'm gonna need you. That's expensive. Just looking. I need you to sell me some cucumber seeds. Okay. Looking good, looking good. <laughs> yeah, there's a fire. So we could send staff here, but like we can't open it yet. Like the kitchen so far is gonna be uh, Charlie here. And the dining area is going to be Billy. Gray. But that's it for now. They're not ready to open yet. <clears throat> There's so, and it just keeps adding more. I love it. Okay. Uh well oh, you can press six to just check branch. Oh, does it just move you there? Oh, there's a little camera. That's so funny. So I don't have to go there. That's incredible. Jesus Christ. All right, how about my own folks? How much is it to train you now? It's expensive now. Yeah, brother! Yo, shorty, one, two, three, four, four. Happy 38 months. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Cucumber. I'll take this one. Oh. Four, three, and two. Oh, we have 36 sea toads, huh? We'll take the sea toad one. Thank you once again. Every 38 months. I was like, I don't think I said it. And then as I was having that thought, I was like, no, I said it. But I'm already, whatever. Hi. <laughs> so let's go to the boat.
Show me my farming report. Yup. Yeah. What we got going on here? Sell you. Uh, just head down to the sea, people. Head uh, to the glacial area. Well, let me just. Uh, yeah, let me head to the. Let me head to the glacial area. Just to go uh, catch some fish. No, I've done like no horse races. Yeah, it's more cat food. <laughs> it is it is not a joke. <clears throat> Believe it or not. You fucker. I don't really want to get you. Leave me be. I'm trying to go get the deeper shit. I'm gonna, I'm gonna shoot you with a gun until you go to sleep. Yeah, I'm gonna have to check out the Yakuza games eventually. I think like there's been enough parallels. <clears throat> oh, I think the pile of rocks over there just moved. Should I check with the camera? Yeah. Ooh. Oh, did I miss my chance? No, it's coming back. Let's go. Whoa, isn't that a cola can? What they call a living fossil? I can't believe it still exists in this ancient form like this. Udo will really like this. Okay. Yeah, I never played potato yet. <clears throat> Eventually. Both of you, come on. Unfair. Please go to sleep. Please go to sleep. Oh god, I'm fucked. I'm over. Leave me be. There was a clam or something, right? You know what? I'll simply leave. Oh god. Oh shit. To the sea people. <laughs> I'll simply come back. Terrifying. There is stuff on the board to do here. I want to get back there, though.
Yes, we love Gurch. <clears throat> Universally loved Gurch. I need more bullets, is what I need. Let me explain what this drone is capable of. I'm gonna play a filter in a video call. Like this. <laughs> what do you think? Haha. <laughs> Hello, Master. I will always be at your side. <laughs> oh, that's great. Will you die or go to sleep? Will you go to sleep? Ah, fuck you. Fuck you. I'll simply have to kill you. Leave me no options. Other than the murder. Yeah. That was very cool. You were not wrong. Please just be like a gun upgrade, because it will refill my ammo. Book. Let me pick it up and put it down. Surely there's ammo somewhere around here. Don't look at me. Let's go. shoot you a whole bunch again. You'll go to sleep. You'll go to sleep. I'm not doing damage, am I? Oh no, I'm just realizing this. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. Hmm. I'm not gonna fuck with him. I... you know what? Yeah, it would make sense. Were my darts hitting him in the belly at all? Can you not? I didn't think you would be this hard to kill. I thought you'd be dead by now. Ice gun. That is pretty cool. I'm gonna pick it up. I'm gonna put it down. I just wanna see what's up down here. Ooh. Please don't kill me. Okay. <laughs> A little scary. I would love, yeah, let's eat this, uh, let's huff this clam. Alright, let me try to shoot him in the ass. Put his ass to sleep. Hey. No. You're very good at moving. I understand. Will you like dart at me or some shit? Oh god. You are so hard to hit in the butt. I will never touch his butt. 
I'll never get to touch his butt. The butt? Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Yo, what's up, Pinky? I've been super fucking into it. I'm gonna shoot your butt. Oh, I was nowhere near your butt. Ah, chillin', chillin'. Oh. Go to sleep. Please, just go to sleep. Yes! Oh my god. Thank goodness. <clears throat> Send his ass back. It definitely has some scary moments. No spoilers to Pinky. <laughs> no spoilers. Ah, oh, nice, Hajio, nice. <laughs> yes. I beat Klaus very quickly. Right now, I'm just gonna swim around catching some fish. But I am pretty deep. Oh, come on. Just go to sleep. Oh my god. Go you know what? Fine. Earned its freedom. I'm just looking to see if there is anything cool I can catch around here, but I think I've caught like one of everything. Ooh. I still don't know what the shovel's for. Maybe I can kill uh, crabs with it. Nothing up here. I can't believe it's already 2 o'clock. I was saying to myself I'd play Dave the Diver for like two hours at the start of the stream and then bounce to something else. It's been four. There should be some bullets around. I'll open this. If it's a net gun, I'm taking it. <clears throat> it is not. Yeah, yeah. Well, it just keeps doing new things. What's this? A dolphin in a place like this? It must be a Lissadelphus Peroni. <laughs> I heard they are pack animals, but that one's swimming alone. Ah, uh, it disappeared behind the iceberg. more than behind the iceberg. A school of dolphins is always a sight to see. Maybe I should take a picture of them? Sure. Fucking looks like I'm not gonna get a damn chance. They're... Alright, that was terrible. <laughs> Let's try to retake that one. <clears throat> I didn't realize we were zoomed in. I thought it was the whole screen. That's a good one. I don't know how far you are, Pinky. Yeah, soundtrack rocks. He really did. I'm gonna head back to boat. I wanna get I wanna get through the day so I can start managing staff. Fair, fair. Yeah, I'm definitely, definitely a ways ahead. Ooh. Oh, you brought a picture or something? Can I see? <clears throat> a cold cola can? A living fossil that barely changed from the Paleozoic era. But no one in the Paleozoic era actually saw it in person, so how can we be sure it's the same? Maybe this is what you'd call an inconvenient truth? 
This picture is going to make waves. Yeah. I'll put your picture to good use. I'm sure the readers will love it. A coelocanth? Ah, see, that's what I said. Wow, a dolphin found among the glaciers? Where have you been, Dave? The Antarctic or something? I found it in the deep waters of the Blue Hole. <clears throat> that's amazing. This Blue Hole is like a gold mine for our magazine. That was a joke. I'll put your picture to good use. I'm sure the readers will love it. There are photo spots everywhere. Keep doing that shit. 